Hello there, my name is Musa Lejain from Deben, South Africa. Welcome to this video where I'll be showing you exactly how to sell Bitcoin and withdraw your money from your Luna to your bank account, all right, especially if you are in South Africa. But even if you are in one of the countries where um, Luna operates, you're going to be able to follow the exact same steps um, to sell your Bitcoin and, um, and withdraw your money to your bank account. Right, so this video assumes that you already watched the first video where I was showing you how to register, create your Luna wallet and uh, deposit money and uh, do all that good stuff like buying Bitcoin. So on this video, that's why I just want to show you how to with the raw, right? So now the first thing you want to do if you want to withdraw from Luna, obviously, is to sell your Bitcoins. So as you can see, I am logged onto my Luna account and this is the price of Bitcoin right now. As of me recording this video, it's um, on the 15th of May 2019. So the first thing you want to do, let's just uh, before we even do the, the selling part, uh, let's just go to the wallet. So I want to show you the wallet. So when you click on the wallets here on the left, you're going to be able to see all your wallets. Uh, this is the Bitcoin wallet, Ethereum wallet and the za wallet so you can see that the only one that contains some money is the bitcoin wallet which is 0 0.04507 bitcoins so now what i want to do is i want to exchange bitcoins into rents because i am in south africa right uh, but as i said even if you are not in south africa in any country where uh, luna operates you, you can just follow the exact same steps and you'll be able to uh, sell your bitcoin so now what i can do i can just click on uh, sell but what i would like to do is to go back to the home page and uh, once I get back here, and uh, if you click the more button, as you can see here, we have the send button, receive, buy. But in our case, we want to sell Bitcoin. So we can come to this menu as well. And then we can just click on sell to sell Bitcoin. So what are we selling Bitcoins for? Are we selling them for Ethereum? No, we are selling them for for za for south african rates all right so now let's just indicate how much of bitcoins we want to sell so as you can see here i have this amount of bitcoin so if i want to sell the entire balance that i have here all i do is just to click there or if i wanted to, to, to sell some of it but none of it i would indicate here maybe for instance i can say okay uh, i just want to sell a 0 0.01 for example i can do that <coughs> excuse me but in this case what i will do is I'll check a sip of my water and then come back to my Luna wallet and just click the entire uh, balance that I have here and I will just click on uh, the next button. On the next page what I will do is I will just um, just review everything to see if everything is correct right so it says that it's going to charge me approximately 2% which is about um, 107 rands um, to exchange bitcoins into rands all right so I'm going to click on Next, and then now I need to indicate that I really want to do this by putting the authenticator code that is generated by Google, right? So you want to make sure that your account is protected. Whenever you're making transactions, you don't want uh, anybody to just uh, hack your account and steal your crypto from you, right? So now um, that's it. I have just sold my Bitcoins into rents, right? So success. Then I'll click the done button. Now let's quickly go back to the wallets now. Now, I no longer have anything in my Bitcoin wallet, but look at my uh, ZA wallet. Now I have 5.3 rands, all right? So now the final step is to now withdraw my rands back into my bank account. So how do we do that? It's very easy. You just go to the more button and then you click on um, withdraw money because we do not want to deposit in this case. We want to with the row, right? So now I just click on that. Now of this balance that I have here, how much do I want to withdraw? this is my bank account i've already uh it's already populated here if i wanted to use a different one i would uh, make some changes here if i wanted to do that but in this case i want to withdraw to this one ending with um, 4036 all right so how much i want to withdraw i just withdraw i want to withdraw the entire balance all right so let's just scroll down a little bit so we have um well i have 5351 rands i want to withdraw i love it right and then click the withdraw button Again, it's going to tell me that um, it's going to charge me only 850. So this is very cheap, you know, if you if you if, when you are doing the withdrawal. But when you're exchanging between uh, Bitcoin and ZA and ZA from uh, and ZA to to Bitcoin, the charges are a little bit high because uh, you are exchanging cryptocurrency into fiat currency or fiat currency into 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 cryptocurrency. So the charges are going to be a little bit high. But when you are withdrawing to your bank now. Uh, they charge a standard uh, flat fee, which is 850 in South African rands, right? So I will receive 5.34285 cents. So now, do I really want to do this? 
yep, I want to do that. Again, I need to verify this uh, transaction by um, entering this code now that was generated by uh, Google Authenticator 127 eight two three and click on authorize all right um now it says withdrawal uh, request created so now when i go to my transactions now i will see that now i have just requested to withdraw this amount of money 5.342 uh, and 85 cents so now if i were to go to my um my gmail account I would have received a email is loading as you can see now it tells me that i have just requested to withdraw that amount of money that you saw in my luno account so my money should be in my bank account um, between 9 and 3 p.m south african time so as you can see guys it, it's very easy so again if you never saw my video where i'll show you the basics how to get started with luno make sure that you click below this video there will be a link to that video and um Go through that video first, and then after you have done that, when uh, the time for you comes for you to withdraw, then just follow the exact, uh, exact same step that I just showed you how to withdraw from Luno, all right? So the withdrawal is uh, pending, and uh, yeah, I mean, Bitcoin is it's, it's really now shooting up the roof. You can see that it's 121,000. Not so long ago, about a week ago, one Bitcoin was about uh, was around eighty five thousand rands. But look at where it's at now. So, and if it, even if, even when you take a look at the charts, you can see that uh, the bulls are back. You know, you can see that uh, we have entered. We have officially entered the bull market. All right. So, um, other than that, uh, let me not confuse you now. Right. I just showed you how to uh, sell bitcoins and. Um, withdraw your bitcoins back to your bank account i hope this video has been informative i hope you learned a thing or two um do me a favor and also do yourself a favor as well just uh, click the subscribe button and click the notification button and subscribe to my youtube channel so that whenever i'm releasing these uh tutorial videos you don't miss out and also make sure that you also get involved with the cryptocurrencies as well if you're watching this and if you don't have a bitcoin wallet make sure that you watch my tutorial on how to, to go about creating your luna wallet verifying your luna wallet and um sending money from your bank account to your luna wallet and buying some bitcoins and ethereum all right and if you want to take things a little bit further, I can also teach you how to buy other cryptocurrencies as well because there are thousands of cryptocurrencies out there. So I can uh, show you exactly how to do that, uh, but on a, on, a, on a different video, not on this one. But uh, there are so many. These are my favorites, man. These are my favorites. Anyhow, sorry for rambling. So uh, that's how we come to an end of this video. Thank you for watching. My name is Musa the Giant from Deben, South Africa. Bye for now.